Hi, my name is Belgica Rodriguez and I'm an actress based out of California and I'm doing a self-tape challenge where I'm doing a self-tape every day and each week is themed differently. Today's template is another question, tell us something about you, 30 seconds to one minute. I am putting myself a time frame because when I get self-tape auditions that require me to just talk, it's really hard for me to... <sighs> put it in a concise way in 30 seconds. That's not a lot of time. I mean, I've already been filming here for a minute and a half and I haven't even gotten started with the video. That's the time frame. And then um, for the slate, it's gonna be name, height, agency, close up smiling, and then full body shot. And something that I've been thinking about for the longest time about full body shot is that I have these awesome um, Savage backdrops, which I am doing a giveaway during this um, self-tape audition challenge or you know what I'm challenging myself to do and inviting you to do if you want it to. I'm giving these away so I'll put the information for that also so I don't have to repeat it in every video. I'll put it in the description and in the comments but I have these paper backdrops but I can't you know unroll it because I have carpet here. Um, I mean I could but then it's gonna get really crunchy and today I thought what if I get something that's flat wait and then maybe I can be able to do it so I have a cheese board here that I'm gonna put right in the middle and I have some weights that I'm going to use for the paper and I just tested it out I think it's gonna work you guys will see in the self tape audition if it ends up working but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna step right in the middle and then hopefully it doesn't crunch up I think it'll work. So it's going to be a full body shot. I'm going to turn the phone vertically, but right now I'm stepping on it and I can of course pull it forward more so that you're not able to see the weights if needed, but I don't think it will be needed. Yay. I think I figured out how to do my slate in my bedroom with the entire backdrop <laughs> because I would have to take it to my living room and it's a lot more echoey over there because here I have carpet over there. There's like hardwood floors. So I'm excited to hopefully get a really good looking slate. For today's question of, you know, tell us something about you. I want to share that I um, like making costumes. It's just something that I really like doing. And also that I have recently started going to music festivals and, you know, a lot of people wear costumes to music festivals. So it like gives me more inspiration to do that. So here's the self tape I filmed for today. Wait, before... I show you the self tape that I am filming for this time. I have filmed this in the past and I did get cast in something for sharing the same story. So I filmed this back in, I think 2017. I look quite a bit different because I weighed a lot less and also my teeth. Um, I don't think I was done or I had just started my Invisalign. So let me show you first the what I did <laughs> um, back in 2017. And I'm realizing, wow, my full body slate was really bad. Even though the room that I have now is a lot smaller than that one. Let me just show you what I turned in that time. Hi, my name is Belgica. I am 5'10 and I'm with Marla Del Talent. And one of my hobbies is to make costumes. And I recently went to my first music festival ever and I made some fun hats to wear. And this is one of them. I call it To the Jungle. It had a bunch of animals on it because I only hot glued them on. They fell off on the way home. But this is one of them. It's the giraffe and it has a little floral crown and uh, it was really fun to wear. A lot of people would come up to me during the festival and just start talking to me about the hat, which I thought was really funny. I didn't realize people were gonna like this silly hat so much, but I, I had a great time. Hola, mi nombre es Belgica, mi dos cinco días, y estoy con Marla Del Talent. Y uno de mis hobbies es hacer disfraces. Y recientemente fui a un festival de música y me hice unos sombreros. Y este es uno de ellos, les llamo a la jungla. Y tenía muchos animalitos aquí, pero se me cayeron porque solo le puse resistol caliente. Pero aquí tengo esta jirafa que le puse una flor como corona y ella estaba aquí arribita. Uh, me encantó ponerme esto en el festival porque muchas personas... Uh, hablaron conmigo sobre mi, mi sombrero y me divertí muchísimo. So you can see the lighting wasn't the best and uh, for the full body shot. And the audition was okay, um, but let me give you an updated one with 2021 me. Essentially the same story. I'm adding a little bit to it, but let me show you. Now let me show you today's self-tape. 
Hi, my name is Belgica Rodriguez. I'm 5'10 with MDT. One of my favorite things to do is make costumes. And usually I only have that opportunity around Halloween time. But in 2019, I finally went to my first music festival and I decided to make some costumes for it. And this is one of the hats I made. I call it Into the Jungle. You can see there's a lion up there and there's other animals crawling around over here. And uh, this hat was really fun to make and really easy to make, but the funnest thing about it is that so many people wanted to come up and take photos of it, ask me about it, and I just got to meet even more people during that music festival because of this fun hat that I created. Let me know what you thought about that self-tape and um, if you were able to see the board during the slate, let me know or let me know if it looked good. And uh, if you ended up doing today's template, let me know the details on submitting to the giveaway are in the description and in the comments. And at the end of every video, I feature another channel. And today I wanted to feature somebody who subscribed to me, who leaves a lot of comments and is super, super supportive. Julian, go check out his channel. Um, he also has some content about acting. So go check him out. And thank you so much for watching. If you would like to be featured on my next video, make sure you're subscribed, like this video and leave me a comment.